Hello, this is Mike with Trek with Mike Texas. Let's talk about fenders on a trike. My current trike is a A sub tie fly 26. Got two 20 inch wheels on the front, a 26 on the back. E assist. I've got fenders all the way around. My previous trike was a Catrike Villager. It had a rear fender only. I could have gotten fenders up front. But you know, when you're buying the trike and you know, things are starting to add up because you have water bottles and this and that and everything else, you tend to say, well, if it doesn't come with fenders, I don't need fenders. And depends on your level of comfort on being wet and mud and everything else. So if I go on a ride here with my villager with no fenders, I go in any little puddle of water, which I don't care how dry it is, Around these neighborhoods, there's always a puddle of water, sprinklers, something that you're going to go through. And a lot of times they're not bad. But every time, every time that water kicks up and then splashes onto your mirrors on both sides. And you say, well, that's not, not any big deal. Well... It's a big deal after not very long. It becomes a big deal. And, uh, move out of the way for this car. And plus, it, it splashes up on you. So it kicks up on the mirrors, it kicks a little droplets across you. And, you know, it could be the cleanest water there is. You got little mud droplets all over you because it's just the dirt from your wheels or, or whatnot. Let's see, where's this guy going? So, with the fenders, you don't have to worry about that. You can go through the little thin puddles. The only thing you have to watch out for are the deep, the deep puddles. See, so you, you still on a deep puddle it will kick up and it will splash your butt. If it's a deep puddle and you're going, you're hitting it fast, okay? Here's my dog friend over here. Such a nice dog. He likes to talk to me as I go by. I'll wave at him. Just say hi, how you doing? I want to eat you. And uh Yeah. He's a he's a friend. He talks to me every day. <sighs> so back to the fenders. It's, yes, they're not cheap. Most of them are a couple hundred bucks. Um, but, it's a lot of aggravation if you don't get them. A lot. You don't realize how much until you get them and then realize how, how much less aggravation. Uh, these, these two mirrors, I haven't cleaned in four months. I have not had to wipe them off in four months. There is absolutely nothing that kicks up to them. In my other one, I couldn't go two rides without having to wipe them clean. Just so I could see through the mud. So, they're definitely, definitely worth getting. Uh, you know, if, 
don't get it right off the bat you'll probably want to get them sometime down the road but you'll never regret getting them let's put it that way you will never regret getting them you will regret not getting them maybe not a lot at first because you're still excited about the trike but over time uh, you will do that and that's why I ordered this one with fenders and my wife's ice adventure HD with fenders thanks for watching